It's time for a knockout of an app review. It's Beast Boxing for the iPhone and iPod Touch. It is Game Center enabled. Essentially, Beast Boxing is very similar to the old Punch-Out game on the uh, regular Nintendo. And, of course, there's a Nintendo Wii newer title as well. Essentially, you've got the same kind of um, trainer helping you out here, this old weathered veteran, except you're taking on beasts or aliens in these fights, and you're disguised to, to take them on. And when you fight, you tap on the screen to jab, and you swipe left or right to go for a left or right hook, and an uppercut is a swipe right up in the middle. So you get the same kind of jump cut stories as you get with Punch-Out. It doesn't seem quite as uh, much fun somehow. I almost wonder if some of the Punch-Out charm came from the low-res graphics, because it looks good. There's something about it, though. There's just a disconnect between uh, punching and, and fighting the, the monster. It just doesn't have the same visceral feel somehow. At any rate, as you're playing, you'll notice that every once in a while, whenever you hit your opponent, there'll be some coins, and you want to put your gloves up and, and block at that point to collect the coins because those are coins you use in the gym where you don't practice, but you buy additional items, strength, stamina, power, those kinds of things, in order to go out and take on your next opponent. And also one little bug to tell you about, uh, the sound disappeared whenever I left the app and came back to it for some reason. But if you go in and turn off the sound and turn it back on, it seems like that uh, makes it better. So again, it's not as engaging as Punch-Out. The graphics are good. Maybe if there was a mode where you were just sort of using an A and B button, uh, and an arrow to punch rather than the swipes and uppercuts and everything. But it looks nice, and it's a decent boxing game for the iPhone and iPod Touch. For the digitallifestyle.tv, I'm Ryan Ritchie.